Hello, welcome to this new video series on formatting your reports and paper brought to you by Knowledge as well. In this video, we will be covering how to format a report or a paper content, content of a paper or a report. In this thing, uh, in this video series, we will be covering how to do formatting for heading, for uh, figure, table number, uh, formatting of figure, num figure table that is basically the numbering of figure and tables, uh, referencing those figure and tables. Uh, in your text uh, if you are from a scientific background we will also cover the to quickly type a scientific equations then we will go to how to make an index uh, list of tables or figures and finally we will end our video series with a reference and bibliography how to do it quickly now basically uh, uh, report making is uh, as you already uh, you may already know that report making is one part of thing uh, is one part but making doing a formatting of a report is really cumbersome it's really bo uh, and a boring task generally if you don't do it properly it also takes a lot of time it, it is time consuming but there are qu quite a f uh, few things that is re uh, that is really easy that you can if you remember you can do formatting just uh, you can do formatting a very less, uh, less amount of time okay so basically we'll be covering all those things by which you, have, you can do formatting really easily which and you can save a lot of time in doing formatting so basically i have a sample report for you um, and this report is, uh, is generally an unformatted report correct this is an unformatted report so i will show you how to do a formatting of this report okay so basically i'll be starting uh, first thing that we'll do is we'll start with heading as we will all we have already seen so in this heading as you can see this uh, here there are some some styles okay predefined style so first thing that you can do is you, you have to select this you have to set the properties of this style property means suppose basically it is a formatting of the style suppose let us say if i do this chap heading one it is it will go to this chapter one so how to do this thing let's do a control z of thing and before all these things you can also you, you need to select this style uh, numbering uh, numbering style so basically if you have, um, if you want to do this kind of thing you can do this this and all these things it basically depends on your um, on your choices suppose if i want um, i'm i'm from a scientific background so i like this kind of style so i'll just select this kind of style okay now after doing, after selecting this numbering style, I will just go to this heading one and two and do a, do a just a formatting once. And if I just click on this, that formatting style will automatically be applied. So I need to do this formatting style for each particular type of heading just once. Suppose if I click on right click on this chapter and click modify, I will, I will be shown this kind of uh, window where we can do all kind of formatting. This I can change the text text to all these things i can change the formats of font size i can change the color of the text bold italics underlines and when what not and what not i can change the spacing between this text and make it left aligned uh, right aligned just uh, justify center line like log, log this and a lot of this not no, this is not the, um, not the only thing that I can do. I can do all all this kind of things. That is, I can set the paragraph settings. That is how much space I need before, after, indentation, left, right, center line, all these things, line spacing. Okay, and most of the things. So if once you do, uh, once you decide what you want, uh, what what kind of formatting you want for the heading one, you set all these things parameters in this window. Or if you or by changing or in this window, and you can also assign a shortcut key for this. Let us say if I select con control one, control number key one, and I, if I say assign, this shortcut key is also assigned. So where I don't need to go and click on this tab, I just I can just use a shortcut key for this. Okay, so this is a short. This is this is a uh, okay. yes this is a formatting that I have selected okay this is uh, heading one you can you can increase or decrease font size as you need suppose okay that you have already seen now if you want, if you want to a section if you want a section heading as 1.1 now th uh, this we are adding a level further the second level 1.1 that, that is there are two numbers so basically you can quickly and easily guess that will come in heading 2 so this is heading 2 okay for heading to if also if you want to select a numbers number style this is a, this is a numbering style 
correct that we have said and this number will automatically update okay again if you want to modify all the settings you can modify it suppose I don't like this color I can change this font I can change font size to 40 in and all these things can that can I can do that's okay okay this font size has not been modified okay yes okay now this is this is the main text and this cover and generally this thing is a normal text you can modify this thing also suppose if uh, if you want if initially for suppose if it's center line you want it to more uh, you want it is in the form of just uh, you want to justify it you can do it you can change again this all these things is common for common for all all of this correct numbering format and all these things this uh, since I have copied pasted this number has auto, auto uh, numbering was also pasted now suppose if I want to make this section as 1.2 1.1 1 1.2 what I need to do is I just need to select this thing and all the formatting will be all will automatically be applied so close okay okay and suppose if I do this thing for normal life and if I do uh, modify it's basically easy if you are doing the formatting at the last point because if you have a complete uh, uh, complete report in the text format then the formatting task is very easy so you can do it even at the last point uh, the formatting can be done at last or in between also it's basically based on your preference what I want to do yes I want to make a shortcut this is control 0 assign close ok ok yes this is control 0 this is normal you can see uh, this uh, what kind of heading this text see this text is uh, this text is of the format uh, of if is of the style heading 2 and this heading 2 is already automatically highlighted suppose if i want to know what kind of style uh, is applied for this kind of text just click on this text and the relevant styles will be highlighted correct right. now suppose this is a literature review suppose this is my new chapter so I want this as chapter number two so this is introduction chapter number two so what I need to do I can go to heading two and just apply it or I can just go and control one whatever I shortcut I have made now if you want this chapter two on the new page you can just do it by kind of shift uh, control enter that is a page break yes and this is chapter two and suppose if this is chapter uh, point two point one you can control two two point two one this is sorry this is normal yes let's expire extra space now suppose if i want this as 2.1.1 okay so i will do just heading 3 again i need to set for the first time i need to set what is a color and all these things and after setting all setting these things you can use it directly this is times new roman heading 2 i want it to left just uh, justify or let's just say i want it bold I can add spaces between paragraph I want it, uh, 10 space uh, before 10 points and after this 6 points all kind of thing I can do heading 2 this is justify all this thing uh, suppose if I want this heading 2 2.2 2, or suppose if I want a heading 3 I can do this right modify I have not set a uh, you can always set a shortcut control 3 assign basically if you have a large um, if you have a very large report this shortcut will definitely help you now heading 3 now suppose if I want uh, if I if I delete this heading let us see the best part of this uh, this kind of formatting is this heading number is automatically updated suppose if I delete this heading number 2.1.2 .2, then this should become 2.1.2 .2 because there is after one 2.1.1 that should be 2.1.2 .2. okay so if I delete this thing uh, this region automatically you can see this heading number is automatically updated and that is the best part so if so if you want to do for uh, if you are adding adding or deleting uh, some sections so that numbering uh, part will be automatically taken care so that is a that is one of the best uh, one of the important advantage that you need uh, that you have in this kind of um, in this kind of uh, formatting style just click on this heading 2 heading 3 and all these things okay 
so that's all in this uh, if you need more headings you can you can just add a heading 4 heading 5 and all these things okay and thank you for this kind of uh, thank you for watching this video if you like this uh, please press like button in the next video we will be covering uh, how to do a numbering for figures, uh, figure and tables